Today is July 24th, 2021. This is Mordecai, host of the updates, bringing you your daily Elden Ring update. So, a few things happened late yesterday, which is why I'm posting today's update earlier than usual. First of all, there was a new tweet from the Elden Ring Twitter account as part of their new Fan Art Friday tradition. As usual, it was a retweet of fan art accompanied by a new quote, and this time it reads, In the distant times before the shattering, wolves dared not to roam the lands between. And this likely explains the premise for the different creatures we'll be encountering. The impact of the shattering war between the demigods paved the way for this new world we'll be playing in, where species like the wolf feel safe to dwell in now. Based on the tweet, I don't think the wolf in the trailer is a player transformation, but rather a species of enemies will be coming across in the game. Even though lycanthropy would be cool, the model also seems too big to be the player character. Though, wolves are very significant in George R. R. Martin's other works, so I won't be surprised if they'll play an important role in Elden Ring as well. In other news, the Tokyo Olympics opening ceremony was yesterday. Now, how is this relevant? Well, the French president Emmanuel Macron was in attendance yesterday, and he met up with some famous Japanese creative minds at a culture pass event, such as the creators of Akira, Fairy Tale, and Dark Souls. Yes, you heard that correctly, the president of France met up with Hidetaka Miyazaki himself. Here's the clip of the encounter with English subtitles. <laughs> And the video sadly cuts off there. So, even the French president knows more about Elden Ring than we do at this point. So, why is he meeting up with these people in the first place? For context, France is currently experimenting with a culture pass where they give high school graduates 300 euros in order to help revive the culture post-pandemic. The president believes Japanese culture is important, particularly for younger people, which is why he's meeting with all these creative minds while in Tokyo for the Olympics. Earlier this morning, From Software's head of marketing, Yasuhiro Kitao, thanked them on Twitter for inviting Miyazaki to the event. This whole thing made me realize that in the last few years we've had George R. R. Martin collaborating with From Software on a video game, Vin Diesel announcing Sekiro as the Game of the Year award winner, Ryan Reynolds mentioning Elden Ring at Summer Game Fest, and now the French president meeting up with Miyazaki. From Software is just getting bigger and bigger every year, and I'm excited for what they have in store for us in the future. Anyway, this has been your daily Elden Ring update for July 24th, 2021. I'm, I'm here to announce I'm the star of Elden Ring.